personally deboost you. He comes to your house and personally deboosts your tweet if you put it in the in the tweet. I don't know if I give that much of a shit though. I don't know. Oh. Uh, nope, no shot. That's fine. Um, whatever. Uh,
Okay, 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 okay. I'm done all my memes. Okay. Okay. True. 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 We're here for Metaphor, the best game ever that hasn't come out yet. Um, but I'm sure it'll be good. Uh, I haven't looked at much Metaphor shit, but I saw this in my feed and I'm like, fuck it, I'll stream Randomizer today and then we'll we'll do this beforehand because it's whatever, it's starting in 10 minutes, so I'm like, screw it. Um, Phantom, thanks for the sub, buddy. Um, okay, why don't we have 10 minutes to kill? Uh, hmm, hmm, what could I do? What could I do for 10 whole minutes? Are you picking a metaphor day one? Probably, uh. Unless it's absolute dog shit. Look at this guy. Please not go woke. Please no pronouns. This guy... This guy has his priorities in order. Atlas, give us Persona 6. Sure. Yeah, it's been a while since I've been live, huh? Like, I think, like, they tried to kill a president in between the time... The last time I was live and now. Um... It'll probably be good. I haven't even... Fuck, I still haven't finished my Vengeance playthrough. You know what I could do? I could... I could just, um, for the next 10 minutes... <laughs> I'm literally meme hunt hunting in Vengeance right now. It's like the most nothing thing, so I can just... I could just do that for 10 minutes. Or I could, like, go on Reddit, but, like, all this is gonna be dog shit. Like, we could talk about why the Persona 5 anime is pretty hated. But I think we all know. Currently watching, I really like it so far. Um, the animation is bad and the pace is fucked. Those are the two big, big reasons. Because, I mean, they are trying to fit a 100-hour video game into, like, the, what, 24 episodes? 26 or something? That was pretty good, yeah, that's true. It's not the worst thing ever. As a compliment to the game, it's not that bad. Uh, yeah, blah, 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 blah. Finds very low efforts. Basically, the major plot points of the game without the nuance or depth. And, uh, yeah, it, I mean, it's it's like speedrun pace. And it doesn't have Mark Yark. What the fuck? Something he did best in multiple movies? People typically say the P4 animation is good. I'm going to be honest. I've only seen the Persona 5 one. I was like, okay. Uh, animation's really- yeah, I don't know why the animation is so bad in P5A. Like, it looks good in game. Like, the anime cutscenes in game. I know, like, two different studios, though. Or three different studios, because I think Royal has a new one, right? I think. Maybe not, maybe I'm lying. I know Mappa does the opening. Right in Royal. Yeah, uh... <laughs> yeah, like, look at- even this looks bad. Like, I- I know this is, like, a, a shot from, like, afar. So it's not gonna be like the most detailed, but like even this for like, even in um, what's the word? Even in like, <laughs> fuck, I don't know, I'm looking for a word. Shit, not in retrospect. In um, oh my god, I'm like I'm blanking. In, I don't know. The point is, even for where it's supposed to be, it still looks bad. No, not in hindsight. It's like in like um. Relation, in relation to where the character is supposed to be. Like, I know it's not typically the highest quality when it's, like, like that. But, like, even then, it looks really bad. Uh, but this is far from the most egregious. Yeah. Even <laughs> Who remembers the all-out attack? Now this, this is Kino. Hold on. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Wow. Now that is good stuff right there. How's he on one? Like, I never seen this one. Well, I have, because I've watched the anime, but I don't remember. What is happening? 
Jesus, it's so rough. How are how are you fucking it up when you're animated? They were able to make it look smooth in a video game. And that was a transition between two styles. Jesus. Yeah, that looks really bad. I don't know why the transition is so rough when, like, this is an anime. The game had to transition you from a 3D model to a 2D one that did it well. How did you fuck that up? What the fuck is this game even about? Let me tell you how much I've come to hate you stuff again to live. Allied Master Computer. <laughs> what, what was he cooking? Bro doesn't- Bro doesn't know he has an accessory. That's crazy. Why do all my Persona have Frey connected to a chain below their name? Bro doesn't know... ...what accessory he has equipped. That's crazy. Yep. Yeah, I get it. I get the joke, guys. Ha, <laughs> that's always cute. He has great taste. Wow, Doctor Doom, our new Doctor Doom. Even he's just bought a copy of Persona 5 Royal. How base. I romance Haro. On the Nintendo Switch. <laughs> Good one. Wow. It must be nice having this game on Switch because then you can play it portably. I'd be like up all night playing the game every time. I don't care enough to buy it on Switch, because, like... <laughs> How many times can I justify buying this game? Maybe I'll buy it one more time. Yeah, I can do it one more time. It goes on sale pretty often. It does help that she is the focus of the... Oh, this is about Haru's character? Okay, yeah, no, I, I agree. I mean, the introduction is what fucks her. Well, the introduction is what fucks her, but then also... The Okuma arc is barely about her, despite the fact it should be. Bathhouse and laundromat IRL. Nice. They made it a real place. <laughs> nice. How does Joker stack against Futaba Makoto Monet? What? Oh, his intelligence? Um. It kind of depends on his knowledge stat, right? Max knowledge? He's smarter than everyone. Uh, use cat again. Jesus, what is this? <laughs> I'll watch out. That wasn't directed at you. Okay. Damn, I mean, this, this, what, it, what this does make me realize is how many people are just getting into the game still. But that shouldn't surprise me that much, because if I go to, like, just Steam numbers alone, right? 8,000, 9, almost 9,000 people is the peak for today. Like... That's crazy for a game this old. Even the Steam release is two years old almost. 2022, right? Like, that is pretty crazy. How many people are still getting into this game? And this is just the Steam numbers. Switch is probably pretty similar, if not higher. Probably PlayStation's pretty close too. Xbox numbers are probably like a third of this, but that together is what? Like almost 30,000 people playing the game every day between all the platforms? Pretty crazy. How am I meant to beat Shido? What's uh, actually, what are Vengeance's numbers at now? I also reloads, I'm curious, I wanna know. How are all my games- oh, Actually, I don't know Tactica's too, cause Tactica bombed within like, <laughs> a week. Well, like a month, but... What's Tactica like? Jeez, that is rough. I didn't even beat the game yet. Fuck, I still need to go back to it. Oh, shit, two minutes till metaphor. Okay, hold on, let me check these. Uh, 3,000 for a reload, so that's not bad. And then what's, because Vengeance had a really good debut. Yeah, Vengeance to be a 21k, that's really good. Still, 3,000, it's good. It's almost as much as reload. Uh, okay. Oh. Oh, they're live. Starts in one minute, 23 seconds, okay. New art book for Persona 5 Royal. This was a while back. I guess this is the English translation. I like, um, when this was scanned, I, I scuffed Google Translated it and then, um, posted a bunch of stuff on, um, on Twitter about it. It wasn't, like, the most interesting stuff, but there was some cool stuff.
<laughs> this is, shouldn't be funny, but it is. Okay, they're starting the metaphor one, and you know what I'm gonna do? While, while they do that, while they introduce it, because you got me fucked up, you think I'm gonna sit here and watch this live stream. I'm gonna do meme hunting in the meantime. And then pop this out. Oh my god, so easy. Actually so easy. Now I get to be happy. I get to be happy. Hold on, where's my... <laughs> We're not playing Persona 5 Royal, get that shit out of here. Hey, Shin Megami Tensei 5 Vengeance time, oh shit. Whoever in the VAs, I have no idea. I've seen like almost nothing on this game. This I've seen the gameplay a little bit. Tribes and three nations, all blessed by the power of magic. Oh my the god, my game's lagging and shit. Of Ucronia. The year is oh 785. Ucronia is shaken to the core by the sudden death of its king. Yeah. My game's lagging so hard. Anxiety breeds dissent among the tribes. Disparities tear them apart. And no mortal mind remembers the heroic tales upon which their land was built. True. Found him. By this story of fantasy, may this faded world be painted anew. It's like fake Makoto Yuki. Now, my you special. Wait, why is that guy a fox? Bless you. I know nothing about this game. I should watch the other ones first. How are you doing today? I'm doing great. Uh, don't you have any street smarts? Come on, kid. Mm. Look, we're not tourists here. We've got to stay focused. Right. You noticed back on the wagon? Well, to be fair, I don't know much about this game, but this trailer, the point of this showcase, is supposed to introduce me to the characters, so I better be, like, I better be interested in them at the very least by the end of this, okay? Hello, everyone. Oh, I saw my spot I am on my phone. Hey! Of metaphor. That's, that's the my guy! My representative works include Shin Megami Tensei 3. Hashino. I always say Hashino. Am I wrong? Persona 5. Yeah, he did direct those in games. In previous showcases, we have introduced you to the story and the world in which the main characters will be competing in the Royal Tournament. In this Atlas exclusive Metaphor Refantasio Character Edition Showcase, we'll be looking at the campaign in its early stage, introduce the rival candidates and their believers, the fascinating supporters who help the protagonist win the election, and the election. The he will form with these characters. Hold on. I will introduce them in more. What kind of game is this? Have done in previous exclusives. We this game have Mega Ten demons in it. Um, new information about. Is it bad? I don't even know the answer to that. Atlas YouTube channel. I think so, right? So please be sure to subscribe to our channel. I wish I give us a like so much by streaming. Why is it like? Do I just have to turn down the graphics? I guess. Showcase. It's annoying. Or maybe it's because I'm display capture, but I'm not gonna fix that now. First, here is a synopsis of the story. On a special mission to save the prince, the protagonist attends the king's funeral to assassinate the mastermind, the great huh? Cardinal Luis. Oh, that's actually kind of hard. Suddenly, the giant face of the supposedly dead king appears in the sky over the royal capital, and the, the royal uh -oh. magic is triggered. Hold on. Whoever can win the most support from the people by the deadline will be the next king. Thus began an unprecedented uprising for the throne, allowing the citizens to be a candidate to become the next king. 
Gathering popular support is not an easy task for regular citizens who have no electoral experience. That has been Sanctifex Forden of the Sanctus Church, a leading figure in the country, declares the Tournament for the Throne as an opportunity for people to put their powers on display and gather support. In this Tournament for the Throne, those who have put themselves forward as candidates for king are tasked to visit the major cities in the kingdom, proving their worth to the public as they tackle tough challenges. The first destination, Port Brylehaven, will host the Exhibition of the Brave, in which candidates compete to see who can bring in the biggest monster head. Those who make it through will head to Altaberry Heights to take on the next challenge. It is Batlin, a Sanctus Crier, who is responsible for informing the public about the tournament for the throne, which has become a truly national event. Batlin! Event. The tournament for the throne! His light-hearted play-by-play keeps the public engaged in the tournament. Right on Queen, Queen Frost. Demon expansion mod, baby. You better believe it. Now, in this national election campaign, candidates with various agendas come forward. The two most powerful men leading the tournament from unassailable positions... What game is this? The one in the showcase is a metaphor. The one I'm playing is uh, Shin Megami Tensei Five Vengeance. Forded Metaphor is the Supreme Authority of Sanctism, the state oh, no, no, the United face. Kingdom of Ukronia, and is also the head of the Crown Theocracy, the government ruled with Sanctism at its center. In the turmoil following the sudden death of the previous king, he has garnered wide support from the population, given his position as the leader of the moderate faction. Luis, on the other hand, in contrast to the moderate Forden, is an army officer with military prowess who believes in true meritocracy, oh. wielding overwhelming combat and magical skills that enable him to defeat the humans. No future exists without the power to eliminate the human crisis. His policy of valuing skill and rationality over birth or circumstance has garnered tremendous support, especially among radical youths. Of course, these two are not the only ones who will be competing in the royal tournament campaign. He's easily the villain. He seems pretty villainous. Other but I, yeah, this is like, like pretty much the first the showcase I've ever watched Each in this game. I should watch the other ones. Platforms. I don't know why I didn't. But whatever. This should the be first one I would like to introduce is Gido. Gido. He is Gido. the primary bodyguard, as well as the captain of the Mong army, the enforcement arm of the Crown Theocracy. That's where the fuck is this meme? In? I can't find him. I see him right here. To be king. But he doesn't seem to take kindly to the arrival of the filthy Elda protagonist. Hey! Are you prepared for the end? Chill out, man. Next, Gladell. Known as Gladell the Black Hound, he is Luis's subordinate, but is a rather Thank ambitious you, man. man who is running for election on the platform of rising to power. Oh, Lord, Luis. Can't even get he makes no effort to hide his open hostility, which may eventually become a thorny issue for you. One of the oddballs is Milo of the Ishkia tribe, who preaches an agenda where those of oh. beauty will strip all the hideous of their titles. Wherever he goes, you're bound to hear the high-pitched screams of his fans. It's Milo Maurizio. Maurizio. Next, the third son of a tavern owner, with the slogan of, all you can drink all year round. Without giving much thought to the future of the kingdom, some might be tempted to agree with Loveless's pledge, which falls in line with his hedonistic parapist traits. Rudolph, another bloodthirsty candidate. Rudolph, look at his elf ears. I just watched Free Run. That shit was Kino, so I'm used to elves. I'm, I'm, all, I'm all game for him. But it is like a fantasy type thing, so it makes sense. I know there's other characters in the attracted the support of those who feel repressed by the rule of moderate Clemars. Lena. A Ujif candidate and the only daughter of the family that runs the Caden workshop is participating to promote the Gauntlet Runner family business. I'll commission runners for everyone in the kingdom. Godard, a demolitionist of the Rogue tribe, is a representative of the elderly, with his pledge to give preferential treatment to the old and tax the young. Roger, Wait, a young man of what? the Clamar tribe, believes in his own righteousness and is pushing forward with his vision of a truly free country with no Did taxes, he just say... no laws, and no religion. Yeah, tax the young. The media tribe is intent and on prioritize the old. Blood, what is your point? Is real cooking. Pledge depending on where he goes and who he needs to please at the moment. We also have Julian of the Ishkia tribe, who is very conscious about pro animal rights, even when it comes to monsters that threaten people. Adeni, 
an island chief of the Mustari tribe decides to participate in the tournament as a pagan advocate for religious freedom. And others with I like the little rabbit guy and the the red hair red hair girl. She's cool too. But the little rabbit is cute. As you can see, the tournament see more of for the throne has a festive aspect with a truly diverse field of rival candidates. But maybe Galica is right. If one of these candidates become king, the country will face bigger problems. This meme isn't on the fucking map of others. The candidates we've introduced are all powerful people who have expensive gauntlet runners at their disposal. And I think you will find that there are many who want to represent the tribe they come from and increase their influence. However, some of these rivals are so impacted by the protagonist's actions down the line that they later become his supporters. I won't go into detail now, but I hope you will look forward to that as well. Posters highlighting the candidate's pledges are posted in cities with influential power. You may want to listen to people's opinions as you walk the streets to see what they think of the candidate's promises and claims made in speeches. During the election period, the protagonist's popularity ranking in the race can be checked by pressing a specific button in the overworld. At the beginning, the protagonist's support ranking starts in a rather low position, around 8,121st place, as you see here. This is not a simulation game where the popularity ranking fluctuates in real time, so it is only a flavor element of the game, but these rankings will change significantly as the campaign progresses. The protagonist is a nobody at the lowest level in the country. Of course, he is not the kind of person that anyone would expect to be king. You will feel the dynamics of this royal tournament campaign as you watch the ranking gradually change with the results of completing your missions and through your actions towards the people of the city. Followers support the protagonist. Now, while there are rivals in the tournament who stand in the protagonist's way, there are also encouraging allies who will support your campaign. In the cities that the protagonist will stay at, there are many people with various kinds of problems. By listening to them and helping them, they will become strong supporters of the protagonist. Okay. Hey, you sure you want to let that fellow go? Oh, of that course, go? The allies who travel with him, such as oh. Stroll and Hulkenberg, Hulkenberg, are also important supporters of the protagonist. But he will also meet unique supporters on his journey who do not directly participate in battle. The unique feature of interacting with supporters, or followers, as we call them in this title, is that you can acquire powerful archetypes that you can equip and use in battle. Let us hey, I noticed that sound effect. That was from Persona 5. We have. You can't hide that from me. First, there I'm is here a for it. Oh, our son. I forgot to have him here. An igniter shop in the royal capital. Of magic By the she way, notices that the protagonist is an Elda and asks him to take on a quest to test his strength. If you can complete said request and gain her trust, she will be a powerful follower. When she becomes a follower, the protagonist will not only be able to awaken to the merchant archetype, which offers more rewards in battle, but you will also be able to make purchases at the igniter shop at the royal capital, which is usually not available to the Elda. Next is a girl named Maria, who lives at the Hushed Honeybee Inn, located in the royal capital. Um... Welcome. So you're going to try Separated from her parents and having no friends due to her rogue and Ishkia mixed real. background, she eagerly awaits the souvenir of stories that the protagonists bring back through encounters they have on their travels. If you can help her feel less lonely, she will also be a powerful follower. The bond with Maria awakens the healer archetype, which specializes in healing and purification. Next is Barden. A Roussant who is the captain of the Guard Corps in Martyra. He is a simple, clumsy, but likable and earnest man who faces new problems after an incident that happens in his town is solved. By supporting him, he will become a strong follower. Your bond with him the combat looks kind of crazy in this guy. Which can bend the I just hope the UI isn't too overbearing, but... Like, visually, it's just nuts. Like Barden. We meet Alonzo in Martira. 
an elusive and enigmatic young man of the Nydia tribe. In the same boat, so why not lend each other a hand? His smooth talk leads the protagonist to undertake a certain quest. You must never show a scoundrel. Even though mercy. he swings the protagonist around with his words and actions that go back and forth, he ends up being a one of a kind follower. If you can strengthen your bond with him, you will be able to awaken the faker that can be used as a trump card to tackle difficult enemies. Last but not least is Katharina, a bounty hunter. Damn, she's cute. She is one of the protagonists. Can't lie. Followers, but she's like also a candidate herself who stands up for her tribe, the Parapus, which is often looked down upon with the pledge to make them wealthier. We'll have our guillotine sharpened and our wallets open. From the bond you form with her, you can awaken the brawler archetype, which can deliver decisive blows. While they may be rivals in the campaign together, they do form a strong bond, allowing the protagonist and Katharina to create a unique relationship. We invite you to see for yourself how the competition between the candidates will play out. In addition to the followers introduced here, you can also bond with fellow party members such as Stroll and Hulkenberg and build a follower relationship with them. Interacting with characters of all ages, tribes, and values, and what, what is this buff ass rabbit, bro? I want to know about him. You have had in previous titles. Strengthening bonds with followers can lead to the evolution of archetypes to higher levels and the unlocking of abilities uh, heard that give you a strategic advantage. So please be proactive and talk to your followers when you see them in town or in Gauntlet Runners. You can check the status of your interactions with your followers, as well as the archetypes and abilities you have acquired through them at any time in the main menu, which will help you strategize how to use your time during the operation periods. In addition, Damn, those fucking the menus are crazy. Are also voiced by talented voice this actors, is the future. Which we believe will provide a deeper game experience. Thank you for your support. Yeah. Yeah. How did you like it? We are pleased to announce that we have released new information on quite a few characters. Okay. Was there a character you liked among the unique candidates and followers? Let us know your favorite in the comments. I like from the ones we've One learned a lot about here. Aspects of this uh, game like a decent amount the about. Fact that the bonding process increases the number of very powerful archetypes. Pink hair girl school. Thinking about what battles. I want to know more about like the the ones that are in the marketing a lot though. The red hair girl and the rabbit. Play a large role in your strategy. I don't know, is he actually like a rabbit? I don't know. He looks like one. It is up to you, the player, to choose a follower in favor of strategy, or choose a follower whose well, circumstances are of interest to you. It is well worth giving thought to. So I hope you look Oh yeah, she does look like Ren. Win. Who's he, who's point, doing the character design in this game actually? Why is lagging? Oh my god. The dungeons, the story, and the characters. Metaphor. However, a new and different aspect of metaphor is the element of enjoying daily activities on your journey. In the next showcase, I will finally introduce the journey aspect in detail. So please stay tuned. Oh, it's Sojima. Once again, okay. Metaphor is scheduled for release this fall on October 11th, 2024. We will be playing. Both the physical October. and digital editions oh. are available for pre-order. Stop releasing so many so fucking games. Your I finish Tactical or, or this one. Along with the standard edition, a digital deluxe edition commemorating the 35th anniversary of the Atlas brand is also available. This is such a crazy fucking collector's edition. Bonuses, so make sure to pre but today. <laughs> I'm playing on PC, and See they made a the PC physical Atlas edition, but it's just showcase. US exclusive. I'm in fucking Thank Canada. Thank you very much for your time today. Assholes. Are they on? Banger alert, hold on. Okay. I, I, I thought it'd be longer, to be honest. I didn't think it'd be so quick. But okay. That was cool. That was cool. I don't... I feel like they could have gone more in-depth 
I feel like I don't know that much about these characters, but I guess they are saving them for the game. It makes sense. Okay, guys, hold on. One more meme in, okay? This prick right here. <laughs> look at him. Look at this guy. I s what? what is bro talking about? Okay, okay, okay. Fuck, I'm like addicted to this game. That's all I want to do. I just play this game. I don't even want to play Randomizer. I just want to play this. Even if I'm just running around grabbing movements. How many left do I have left? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, Shinjuku. Okay. Okay. Um. What's a meme? These like these little guys, and you collect them, and they give you glory. This thing up here, and you use that to um get like different. I guess you could call them like upgrades for your character. That's what I'd call them. For my for my little guy, my little Nahobino over here. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Fucking okay. I need that game to have a randomizer, but I can't figure out how to do it because nobody's made tables for this game. Or no, nobody's made um, uh, like the hex editor files to understand it. Okay. Okay. Uh. Okay. It's time. It's time for the worst challenge ever. <laughs> the one that's been torturing me for years now years years of my life it's certainly taken off um persona 5 raw randomizer metaphor randomizer be hard that'd go hard uh Okay. Oh my god, dude, my, my whole body is like aching. Every muscle is aching. I don't know why. I just, I feel like dog shit. And like, this is gonna push me to the limit now. Oh, hit a last surprise. Get his jump skimmer in that. Okay. Uh. So, our last run died in Madarames on the exact same fight. Uh, let me put this in the perspective, okay? Um, our farthest run ever was one of the mini-bosses in Madarames. Uh, we had finally made it... We've only made it to Madarames before that one time. And that's where our run died, right? That was our farthest run on that mini-boss. We made it back to Madarames just for it to die... On that exact same mini boss. So we've only made it to Mondorame's twice, and it's on the same mini boss both times, which is really annoying. So now we're back at Kamashitos. I have to re randomize. Um, I don't even know if my attempt number is accurate, so I have to go figure that out. What did my attempt number even say? 46. No, we are on 47 now. God, I remember this run was going so well, even though we had to wait 20 minutes to kill Shadow Sai. But it was going well. <laughs> Until it wasn't. Okay. I'm doing my randomization right now, as we speak. Okay. Uh, yeah, just rig the baton past the door. I mean, <laughs> I would never. I'm gonna say that, and it's gonna be like four pixies this one time, and it, no one's gonna believe that I didn't rig it now. Good. Optics terrorist. That's what I am. Who ended the run? I don't remember what the enemy was. I just remember it being busted. Wasn't it like the big uh, red dragon guy and like a few other? I don't remember. But it was that Madarame mini boss, that same fucking one. I think it's like three enemies, right? That must be why. Was it different in vanilla? No, I'm losing my mind. I, 
No, stop. You're saying too many words, you, you can't back up. Ooh, I don't even remember what random persona we had either. <laughs> Clearly it wasn't good enough. The game is like, it's launching by the way. I don't know why it's like, not launching faster, but. Okay, what the fuck? Launch! Oh, it had Kamashita's yeah, it did, didn't it? That thing was kind of, that was fraudulent. That shit was trash. It should have been better. Okay, Jesus, why is this thing not launching? I guess we're just not doing it today. Oh, okay, there we go. Fuck. Almost got out of it, guys. All right, time for fun. Who's ready to have fun? Me, me, I am. I'm ready to have so much fun. Uh, let's save this one. Oh yeah, hold on, we have the save still, hold on. So we had, this run we had Bugs and Kamashita. Yeah, this, oh, Inferno is okay, I think. Damn, we kinda, we kinda, we kinda like hard, because this guy isn't that good. And then we had, yeah, Karon, whatever, with a uh, gold medal spike. Okay. We can, t we can top that, we can do better. Let's do it. Okay. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna pull out the random persona and miser. That's what we call it now. I'm gonna forget that name by tomorrow. And what random persona will we be getting? Could be any random persona in the game that is normally obtainable. Even Izanagi no Okami Picaro, the goat. Who's it gonna be? Who's it gonna be? Orthrus. Orthrus, you said. Is Orthrus good? I don't remember. I still don't know all these demon names for some reason. Off the top of my head. Like, I can never put, like, a, a mental image sometimes. No? Orthrus is like, um... Oh, that's really not that great. Yeah, it's you. Yeah, of course. You're forgettable, to be honest. You're not that interesting. Two-headed. You're like the meme. You're like the meme guy. There are three wolves inside of you. Three of them are gay. <laughs> That's mine. That's my wolves inside me. Uh, he guarded a herd of Rex oxen, but was killed by Hercules during one of his 12 labors. Wow. Agilo, double fangs, and Muragi. Drains fire, which is kind of nice, but uh, weak to ice, strong against nuke. Okay. And the random skill we're gonna get, we get one random skill, could be any skill in the game. Boss skills, unused skills, anywhere in between. Zero to 1056, those are all the IDs. Which one is it gonna be? Number 104. I don't even know what this is. Spirit Drain! Eh. Oh, two Spirit Drains. Two whole Spirit Drains. That's crazy. Couldn't be me. Uh, Spirit Drain, um, drains 10 SP from one foe. Yeah, uh, as you can imagine, that's not the most useful. Well, if we're trying to go for, like, strats where we, like, make the enemy run out of SP, maybe, but, uh, it's not exactly the most viable. Uh, okay. Sorry. Okay, here we go. Here we go. 
Anyway, I'm gonna. I'm so confident this is gonna be something good in here. Yeah. Oh, well, it's a beach can. I mean, I can't complain. But I will. I wanted like a like a good armor or something. All right, come on, give it to me. We love crashing. We love crashing here, guys. That's actually our big fan of Persona 5, but better. That's our favorite thing to do is crash the game. Yes, I love modding. I need to. I need to get on reload of randomizer. I need to hop on that soon. The problem with that is. I still haven't finished it. <laughs> like, I haven't even... I There's, like, fights that don't work, and I have to go... I have to go make exceptions to them. But I'm too fucking lazy to code all that. I thought you got through the whole dungeon and beat the randomizer boss last time. Uh, for Kamoshida, we did, yeah. But uh, we didn't beat Madarames, and yeah, it's, it's so brutal that we go all the way back to the start. But, hey, with this rule set... Well, it was a little less brutal in, in randomizer, but uh, in a vanilla randomizer. But that part was the same in vanilla randomizer, where we'd reset all the way back to the beginning. We beat the whole game. You know what? We're gonna do it again. I feel it. We're gonna do it right now. This is the one <laughs> with Spirit Drain and Orthrus, the two best best persona and move combo. You did Madarame? No, I didn't finish Madarame. I got into Madarame. And then we lost. Okay, nice. Two crashes in a row. Can we go for three? That's always great. Who's ready for this run to die in... <laughs> Kamashita fight? No. It's not gonna die. No, it's the one. Uh, this is the one. What am I talking about? This is the one. This run's not dying at all. Ever. We're making it past Kamashita. We're making it past Madarame. We're making it past... Um... We're gonna skip Kamashiro. <laughs> we're not even gonna fight him. He's gonna be scared of how powerful we are. He's not even gonna try. Okay, Jesus Christ, dude. Launch the game. Launch the game. Launch the game. This is the one. This is the one. Right here. Right now. Take this. Show me your true form. No. Oh. Now we're in. Um. What the fuck? Hold on. Shio. Wait. I don't know. I don't know if we've ever gotten Shio before. That must be new. I don't know if I've ever seen him a randomizer before. Okay, uh, Shiho Suzui's here. She's weak to everything, naturally. Um, nice of you to join this cognitive of Shiho Suzui. Ooh, this isn't bad either. This is a, this is a Madarame level enemy. You are gonna probably be annoying. Uh, you could be from a few different places, I think. I do recall you in a Shido mini boss though, which is annoying if you're that, if it's that one. And then Shadow Magami? I don't even know. This is a Mementos mini boss. I don't even remember where this is from. Uh, overall, could be worse. These two are free, but could be better. Uh, let's try to get. <laughs> we don't even have a good skill. I guess Maragi is like our strong skill here that we can just use. They won't. Yeah, I guess so. Okay. Um, we're gonna. Okay, I don't have to go. Fire on Shiho, who probably can't attack at all because she needs Kamashita with her. You're gonna do that. Pass to Joker. And I guess Miragi is our best bet, right? Uh, I've seen better. And we're gonna crit this. Nice. We're gonna crit this. Nice. I mean, okay, stagnant air. Let's see how they react. 
That's really hurtful. You're not even the hard one. What are you gonna do? Nothing, right? Yeah. <laughs> what? What? Oh, God. Okay. Okay, I see how it is. Um, we could do... Do you think shock strats are better here? Or free strats? I think shock, right? I don't know what you're gonna do next is the problem. Uh... Wow, really? Okay. Um... Okay, I'm gonna try this. Nice one. Uh... Yeah, no. Hold on. Yeah, okay, hold on. Start with this. Wow, what? Can you not be shocked? Hold on. Don't tell me. Oh, you can. You're just a bitch. Alright, fine. We'll take one turn off on here. Uh, can you not be shocked? Jeez, kill me. Thanks. Thanks for that. Okay. What are you doing? What are you doing? Can you stop fucking things up for me, Morgana? Oh my god. Well, there's minus one baton pass right there. That's great. Can you... Is this gonna be frozen? Again, okay. Okay, I do this. And this. And let's see what this does. Hey, that ain't that bad. That's not that bad. <laughs> no. Ah, uh, it's alright. That's okay. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna heal here. I've seen worse. That's hurtful, though. Why are you doing so much damage? Okay, and you're just... Like, I don't even know what's going on with you. Oh, oh we're dead. Oh, wow, nice. Thanks, man. Yep. They comboed me. That's crazy. Um, oh shit, I don't know. Uh, okay. I'm like thinking, like the wheels are turning, but it, it might rely on a little bit too much luck, so we might have to reroll. We'll see, we'll try. Oh, so one more thing here. Level three pass. How much are we doing? Why was that? Why that? It didn't down. Okay, this I'm being trolled, aren't I? That's not right. There. There we go. Okay, now I have to worry about you killing everyone, though. Yeah, why are you so annoying? Oh my god. What do I even do then? You know what? Actually, doesn't bug start with stagnant air? So I don't even have to shock him first. I'm gonna shock... thing. Okay, kill me, just kill me, just kill me. Oh wait, you gotta get one more off you. Okay. Um... He didn't start... Okay, I'm so lost. Doesn't he start with stagnant air? He did that the first time. Okay. Thanks. Uh, okay, um, so I would think the optimal thing would be this, then we get our passes, okay, this has to down, come on. Why? What the fuck is your problem? Alright, and then I'll shock you then. Yeah, fuck it. And then we'll see what Bugs does. Yeah, he starts staying in air, so I can get him next turn. And now I got minus one uh, baton pass, though. I can't believe it didn't down. Why is it not downing? I know it's. I know you have to rank up technical for it to be guaranteed, but oh my god, thanks, man. 
Well, now I get no baton pass. That's fucking amazing. That's great. Thanks, guys. Thanks, man. We're going to do anything other than immediately hurt himself as soon as this fight starts? Doesn't seem like it, right? The best thing you can do is stay out of my goddamn way. I can, I can kind of get a down here. I guess that's a strat. Oh, okay. And then he'll still be shocked, yeah. There we go. Did I beat Vanilla P5 Randomizer? Yeah. Like two years ago. But I haven't done the uploads for it yet. Uh, I don't think ALA is worth it here. Now this guy's gonna- now, here's the problem. This thing's gonna heal from shock now. And I, I've only got it down to half. I don't know, I just gotta go for it. Oh, bro. Uh, this is gonna kill me. Oh, nice touch. I'm dead here, though. Yeah. Alright, yeah, fuck it. Not against this fucking Cheeto level prick. No shot. Yeah. I'll just reset. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna drag that out. We got really, we got a really shit persona and a really shit skill, and then we had to get to deal with that on top of it. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good on that. Thanks, man. Though. Thanks for the offer. Uh, okay. New random persona. Cooked in the first battle is crazy? You must be new here. That fight is hell in randomizer. And it's new to royal. That was not in vanilla, that fight. So this is, like, new to royal randomizer, like, hell. I should just play on keyboard. I should learn keyboard controls for this game. I'm lying. Okay. Um, new random persona. Let's go. Pisaka. Is Pisaka the high level in this game? That's uh, better. This guy's always like, look at how weird he looks. What a weirdo. This guy's from Hindu lore. Those who see one, wait, a type of pre preta or hungry ghost in Hindu lore that eats human corpses, enters a human through the mouth and causes harm. Those who see one are said to die within nine months. Okay, well, I started my first playthrough of P5R like <laughs> four years ago, so catch the fuck up. Uh, Dream Needle, Rampage, and Stagnant Air. Um, Rampage is actually really nice to have. Team Needle's okay, too. Uh, weak to Fire and Bless, though. Two weaknesses is really not good. Uh, strong against Elec, Elec and, uh, no curse. He's not a raw man? Level 20, um, I don't know. We can find out. It's not that important. Um, Dota 5 Royal. Uh, bup, 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 bup. Why is it telling me the mementos area you find them in? Because the fourth area, or no, the act. I don't know how to say it. Well, he's in one of the palaces, I'm sure. Uh, okay, anyways. Um, okay, random skill, please save me. Save me, random skill, please. 246. Come on, please. Regeneration. Okay. What the fuck is regeneration? Blank. Yeah, I figured. All right, can I take a guess? I'm going to check. I'm going to check. Can I take a guess? Isn't this what um, Madarama uses when he brings back his, like, the pieces of his face? You know? Like the... Um... Yeah, like, like, when, like, if the eye dies, then it'll be revived by the others. I'm gonna go check. The way, the easiest way to tell would be where it is with the other skills. They like to put skills beside each other. If it's with the other Madarame skills, I mean... 
Oh, not really. Not used. <laughs> okay. Rising Slash. If we got one under, we got not used, guys. The best skill ever. Tyrant's Purge. This feels like it's, um, Cheeto. I don't know. Mass Ball? These are a bunch of physical skills. Enemy only skill. Okay, I'm actually more confused then. I have no idea. I would have thought it's the Motorame one, but now I'm second guessing, because it would be with the other mod. What's like a skill? The artist's, um. Oh, these are the new royal ones, though. Where's the ones from vanilla? What is he using vanilla? That's like a unique to him. Uh, oh, the, um. What's. Yeah, it's like artist. Yeah, the artist grass. Okay, it is artist grass. Restore. Oh, so it's not the one then. He uses restore in that fight. Huh. But what the hell is regeneration? I have no idea. Make sure. Oh, this guy's too good. He's too good at the game. Okay, this guy's too good. I need someone who's trash. Damn, all you are too good. Stop being good. Stop, 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 stop. Damn. That's the same video? No. Okay, I don't know. It's probably Restore, right? Yeah, whatever. It's probably Restore. Okay, so what is Regeneration? We're gonna find out. We're gonna find out. Marky? You think so? Let's do it. Maybe. I don't remember. But why is it with such weird skills? We're gonna find out. We're gonna go use it. In this fight. Did they ever randomize? <laughs> hold on. I did, right? Yeah, hold on. I can take the timestamp. 940. Yeah, okay, I did. Show me your true form. No target available. Okay, I need one of you to die. And not me die. Me no die, you guys die. Oh, I'm gonna die. Okay, actually, no, that worked out perfectly. Okay, hold on, that was actually perfect. Okay, now, don't kill me. This is the Shido mini boss, right? The, the Yakuza guy? Uh oh, I'm done. Well, actually, I'm strong against this, but I'll probably still die, right? Yeah. You know what? I'm sure, just like, just like the climax of your favorite anime, I'm sure we'll find out when the time is right. So you know what? I'm not gonna dwell on it. We're just gonna go into the fight. Take this. Isn't the skill that brings back Yellow Boss weapons? <laughs> I don't know. I have no idea. I'll reveal your I'm lost in the world. I'm new in the city. And there's Marky in the fight. I'll show you an example to Uh, okay. Um, I don't know what this guy's doing here. For now, not gonna worry about it. This guy, he's, this is, this is a little basic bitch market. What's this guy, what is this guy gonna do to me? Nothing. Not a goddamn thing. Um, this guy should be free. Ooh, yeah, that should be free. Uh, I don't really remember where you're from, so you might be a little scary. Uh, I don't really remember you either. I can see through your head, though. Um, okay. Okay, so fire. Can't do anything about nuke. Elec, though. Fire elect. Okay, we can get baton passes. Now, the thing is, do we have, like, a crazy skill? We Rampage is good. We can probably do some... We can probably put in some work at Rampage. All right, let's try it. Oh, that wasn't that bad, although it missed the important ones. But at least this guy's dying quickly, so you shouldn't be that big of a deal. I'm worried about you. Crit him. Impressive. 
All right, send it. Oh, they look killable, at least. Let's see what happens. Okay. Okay. Ah, oh, not wage war. What are you gonna do? Wait, why do you have bloodbath? What the hell? Where is he from? Why do you have bloodbath? Why do you have so much health? I thought you were like Kamashita's could have misjudged. Oh fuck, this might be harder than than I expected then. We're gonna have to do shock stress for sure, I think. Okay, Marcus. <laughs> he dies easily. Um Okay. Shock these two, because they're killing everybody. The thing will wage war, which is annoying, but I'll deal with it. Ah, oh, of course. Like, of course it just lands. It just does, doesn't it? Nice, you took the shock from him too, dickhead. What a perfect skill to have in this scenario. No, take, take the shock! Okay, you didn't. Good. Oh, because you're already on with them. Wait, no, that's not how that works. Um, okay. <laughs> Fucking hell. Um. Uh, what do I even do about this? What do I even do about this? Is there anything I can do? Like, let's say I- okay, I can get technicals off the rampage- I can get- okay, I can get the three baton passes, and I can get the technicals, because I can shock them, and the baton passes from the, um... The baton passes from the... You know, the, the two enemies that are, have weaknesses. And I can rampage. And that I should do decent damage, but, I don't know. Freeze wouldn't transfer? Yeah, but the problem with freeze is it doesn't stay. Freeze gets broken when you, um, hit it. What did we do last time? Yeah, we'll just... You know. No, this is the wrong way of doing this. I'm doing this wrong. There's a better way of doing this. Let's use slime attack again. Go ahead. Oh. Yeah. Like, wow! Why do you have that? How much health does he have? You think? Too much, huh? Okay. All right. Thanks. Good. Good work. Good. Now you. Now I can't. Yeah. Thanks, Dickhead. Yeah. Thanks, you fucking moron. Oh my god. I'm gonna. I wish you was gonna rage quit it. I'm actually gonna. Like I can't take this. I'm not the young lad I used to be when I played Vanilla Randomizer. Okay. Fuck, why did they take no damage? I don't even know if it's beatable. Who's even shot? Wait, did I get rid of- What is happening? I'm actually so lost. Am I even playing this game? Wait, am I even- Alright, the shock worked on him. Did I double shock him or something? Am I, like-
Yeah, Mark is just gonna stand here. <laughs> no death animation on Mega Lola. I'm fucked though. I don't think it matters. Oh my god, like at least kill one. Jesus. Ah, yeah, yeah, it's over. I don't care anymore. Yeah, yeah. Nice. Wow, 1604. Dude, sure. Humble. Humble amount of damage. This is worse than the last one for sure. Fuck this. Fucking, and I, like, and then they give me, like, the fucking most dog shit personas in the game. Like, it's actually, like, it's actually comical how bad, like, my luck has to be. I'm going invisible to not piss off my entire friends list by, like, continuously opening Persona 5 Royal. Wait, I have to re-randomize. What am I doing? Don't open the game. Close the game. We gotta see regenerate? Oh, yeah, you wanna see regenerate? True. Sure. Yeah, you're right. Okay, well, hold on one more. You're right. You're right, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. You're right. We do have to see what regenerate is, because I am as curious as everyone else. So, like, why is he just, like, randomly with... How many skills are named regenerate in this game? Only... Wait, what? Oh, regeneration, sorry. Yes, yeah, this is the only one. Every copy of Persona 5 Royal Randomizer is personalized. Okay. It's based on how many sins you've committed in your life, and I must have been fucking Hitler with how fucking bad they treat me in this fucking game. I should say my past life. That would have been funny. Fuck. Alright, um... I don't know. We'll, we'll just pretend we're gonna... Uh, well, no, I'll get one more shot for here. Fuck it. Um, okay, I should start with this. No. This. No, oh, wait! Wait, no, okay, now that was my fault. I'm supposed to take the slime first for- okay, uh, whatever. I'm throwing, I don't care. So can I use regeneration or no? No. Okay. I'm gonna assume this one needs to be dead. It sounds like the type of skill you use with someone who's dead. Oh, we didn't shock you? Okay, pal. Oh, nice one. Who are you gonna pass kill? Nobody. Nice, you're gonna take the shock from him though. You're gonna help him. Can't imagine why that happened. Awesome sauce. This guy's actually killable. Who's next? It's actually the slime who's actually the hardest one. I don't know where this slime is. Bloated, rotting meal. Oh! Are these from the, um... From the last layer of mementos in Royal? Is this, like, the hard version of basic enemies? Is that what this is? I can't even tell. Oh, I think... I don't know. Oh no, maybe these are challenge battles? I don't know. Alright, oh, nice. Oh, it is. Yeah, it is. It is. Oh, this guy's a list. I'm saving that. That's useful. Yeah, it is. Oh, that's why you have bloodbath, you prick. <laughs> Yeah, well, that's literally like a level 70 something then. Yeah, there's a, no surprise I couldn't be that. Uh, I'm gonna make sure I don't die here. I kill a teammate. I want to use the thing. What is your problem? What the fuck? Okay. I'm just sorry now. I just want to use regeneration. I don't care. 
Tank Hill. What the? F oh, I need to get. Yeah, I need to shock him. Otherwise, it just kills every time. No, Bobby. I need to remember more quotes. I watched two seasons last year. I should know. Um, yeah, you might kill us all in one hit too. You typically don't, but. Look at his pose. Th that pose is actually hard. His elemented pose. Bro, is the ice. I right, please just kill somebody. Okay, I lived. Okay, oh, wait, wait, don't kill me. Oh, right, I mark one attack. Okay, we're good. Okay. All right. Wait. No. Stop. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, yeah, propane and propane accessories, yeah. That's like the meme. It's like the show's meme. How did I forget that? Alright. Fucking kill me. But not really. Maybe regeneration will be so good it'll save this run. Shocker. Okay, okay, okay. Don't recover from your element. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. That's bad. 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 Don't do. Okay. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Yeah, that's really annoying. How this is. This is. This has happened twice now. This happened twice now. We're gonna be trolled. I feel like there's a, there's a, they're, they're gonna reveal the camera crew pretty soon. Okay, fuck off you. If you just want to do single attacks, then you know, this guy can fuck off too. Just shoot this guy, because I don't like looking at him. And guards. Oh my god, you ailment Andy. Oh my god. I'm gonna die here. I'm gonna die here. I'm gonna die here. I'm gonna die here. Maybe it heals ailments. Maybe we'll be able to use it this turn. Oh, no. Okay. Okay, can you kill somebody? No, well, you will. I know you will. No, you got one more? Okay, you're all you're all dickheads, you know that? And I hate I hate you. The problem is here, the problem is they keep immediately killing everybody when they kill. I need to find a way to make Joker live. Like who will attack one person? You'll just, you're just gonna wage war, because you're annoying. You're gonna bloodbath and kill everybody. Like, it has to be this guy. It has to be him. But he sucks too. Oh my god. Okay, yeah, I shouldn't, I shouldn't do it for, he always target cards this first turn. Alright, this is actually the big brain strat. This is the big brain star right here. I don't know why, I haven't figured it out yet, but. Yeah. Hey, answer me. <laughs> that was the worst possible thing that could have happened. Okay. No, I shouldn't even have done that. Uh, you know what? We should just guard first turn. Let them do their thing. Because none of them do anything first turn. They're all annoying. Look, they're all cringe, right? 
Cringe, 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 cringe. I'm cringing. I'm actually cringing behind the chair right now. Okay? Now, now you guys start attacking. So, you better not attack Joker. Even though it seems like you only do. Uh, who do I want to bet on? I'm going to bet on this guy one more time. He better pull through. Alright, come on. Come on, don't attack Joker. Wait, oh, we- oh, I forgot- okay. Yeah, no, I forgot you suck at everything and I hate you. <sighs> Dodge! Uh, okay. I need to remember, if you down him with the thing, he doesn't get ailment for some reason. I need to remember that. I need to remember the game is really bad. Okay. No! I'm not supposed to do that. No, stop! Guard, guard, guard. Stop. Stop at doing things. Don't even close your eyes. Nothing's happening. Nothing. Everyone's okay. Everything is okay. You can go home now. It's almost scary how good, oh, scary how good I am. Liar. Okay. Okay. We're gonna freeze you. We're gonna freeze you because you suck. And then, and then, and then, boom. What's gonna happen? Oh my god. Oh no, he recovered too. <laughs> oh, help! Uh, okay. okay, no, stop. Okay. Fuck this fight. Let's just test it on a different fucking fight in the game. There's like a million encounters in this game. There's like two thousand, million, hundred. She's on one. She's on one of them. She's on one. I think mean, I could have just cheat engine to be fair, because it, it's not like we're doing this run. It's just like for the memes. You just want to see what regeneration does. Is that so much to ask? That's so much to ask what this unknown skill does. Nobody's ever seen this skill used before in the history of mankind. That's probably actually true. So like, can we make history? Like like the like the song from the game? Alright, you know who's gonna be nice to me? This encounter right here. I'll reveal your true form. Oh, it's these pricks again. No, these guys just kill me. I need to no. It was my vanish ball. Okay. Bum 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 bum. I am my Okay. Okay. No, wrong. All right. This encounter right here. Now this is the nice one. Uh, I mean, I've seen worse. They won't kill me. Okay, good. Okay, just don't kill Joker. Just don't kill Joker. That's all I need. I just want to use this stupid skill. Just don't kill Joker. That's all I'm asking. <gasps> oh, it is from Maraki! Oh, so it's just a full revive. Oh, but, okay, but we do now we know where it's from at least. That's the Maraki Tendril skill. Someone, someone in chat got it right before. So it's just like a free full heal, basically. That's right, nice. Not gonna help us beat the fight though, so we're still resetting. Wait, did I? Uh oh. What? What? Did I update the attempt number earlier? I don't remember. Hold on. This is why we stream on YouTube now. Because look at this. Look how much easier it is to go into the VOD. So. 47. This was the cringe one. Then this was the ultra cringe one. So yeah, we are on a 49. Okay. Good. Alright. This one is the one, guys. I know I said about the last two, but this one's like the one for real. Hey, can we just get like a decent persona? We did it last time with bugs, and he's not even that good. Let's give me something decent, man. Like, aren't there more high-level personas in this game than low-level ones? I think so. Like, at what point... This is sorted by level, so, like... 
what point do we hit level 50? Like, my god, Susan, that's like level 50. So, like, anyone, like, here and above is, like, pretty decent. So, like, how many of these are there? I put this in, like, a notepad. 120. Out of how many in total? 231. Okay, it's like half. It's like 50 50. But it doesn't feel like 50 50. It feels like. It feels like 20 80. Okay, where's my. That just closed my RNG. Nice. Base. Oh, okay. No, that's fine. That's cool. This doesn't count. I didn't press the button. That doesn't count. Let's go. Athena! Oh, Athena's okay. Athena's alright. Everyone in chat tried to predict it. None of them got it right. But, I mean, it's 200-something personas in the game. Not easy to get right. Athena. It's a DLC persona. That's gotta count for something. Uh, I guess, right? <laughs> look at look at look at it stare at you. <laughs> he has a little face, little idiot. Okay, um, I could oh, I don't know how to say this. I, I could arts. I I I could I cut whatever. Screw you. Um. Uh, that's pretty decent, right? That's that's pretty okay. It's pretty all right. That's a good skill. It's better than alright. That's a good skill. 30% crit chance. The accuracy is man, but I mean it does good damage. Um Mark Kajas, nice to have, that's nice. And I'm not gonna forget about rising slash right. That's a good persona. Strong against physical, null against um uh gun, which is actually nice attributes to have. Weak against Alec. Akashik. Akashik arts. Oh yeah, that makes sense. If I'm saying it right. Shik? Shit. Artistic arts. Okay, anyways, we get a random skill on top of that. 625. Absolute cinema. Manifest book! <laughs> That's actually very funny, because today I made this meme. I was inspired by one of the SMT5 Vengeance, um... Demon Hunt dialogues. This guy said, how many book one of the meme oh sorry, no, this is one of Demon Hunt. This is one of the memes. He said, How many books you buy over year? Game good too, but so is read book. Absolute cinema. Absolute cinema. And it all comes back. Now instead of vengeance, we're playing Persona 5 Royal, but we're manifesting book. Cinema. Uh, okay, Manifest Book, I think, if I recall, is Yaldabaoth skill, yeah? And it's referring to the book arm, right? Um, I have a feeling the game's not gonna like if I try to use this. I have a feeling it's gonna crash. Uh, now we can go try it, but I, I, just, I just don't get your hopes up. If you think I'm gonna use it and now we're gonna have a book alongside us fighting, I'd, um, I'd, uh... I I I get your I I temper your expectations. Cinema isn't game or book. Absolute literacy. Show me your true form. All right. Okay, Lily told not me. <laughs> hey, he uses 18 SP though. What if one of them die? Can I like replace them with a book? I have a feeling that's not how it works. These guys are like beatable. Can I get these guys with the baton fast fight? Okay. If we crash the game, do we get a no move? No, we just kind of have to. We just live with manifest book forever. Oh, oh, not that. All right, man of make book. Wait, what? Ah! I'm new to scene. Hold on. I'm new to. I'm noticing. I'm new to scene. I'm like the nudiser. That was a free re no, not free. That was an 18 SP recarm with a pretty broken animation. Okay, Ryuji became book. 
Absolute literacy cinema. Literacy cinema. Wow. So is that how that skill actually works internally? It's just a recarm, but it's named manifest book, so it looks like it's its own skill. Wow. I mean, that makes sense. They come back with half HP, right? Okay, that actually makes perfect sense. God, this game is coated with, like, this game was stuck together with, like, glue. And tape. And string. Okay. Anyways, I'll take it for your card. Fuck it. Yeah, I mean, I have the bomb of life, um, but, you know, I'm not gonna complain about it. Okay, at least it does something. Alright, let's go. Yeah, basically it's the last... Uh-uh. Get him out of here. No, I'm fucked. Can we get a nice little screenshot of this? That's a good thumbnail. Um, unfortunately. Unfortunately. I think, um... Here, I'll get that, get that screenshot real quick. Unfortunately, I think we're fucked. Um... I just, something, something's... Something's telling me. <laughs> something's telling me that we might be screwed. And I, I can't exactly put my finger on it, but there's a little, a little just inkling in my head that's telling me might be screwed. Um, this is actually such a hard pit. Look, okay, can we take into consideration how hard this goes? Though he's bigger than the whole room. That actually, it's like it's almost menacing in its own way. Whoops. No, no bring me back. I went too far. God, using this camera is like the worst thing ever. Oh, I'm just stuck now? Um, okay. Okay. Um, anyways, my worry is even if he doesn't attack, how much health does Adam Cadmon have? Because you're not supposed to beat him. Remember, you just kind of go into a cutscene in the game. Oh, boy. Which one is it? Is it with Marky? Because that one has 3,000. Is it Fuse? Because that one has 99999. I'm gonna hope it's the first one. Okay. Uh, and also, by the way, even if... even Oh, it's the second half. It's named Adam Cadmon second. We need to fire, though. That's weird. Um, even if... Even if we could somehow beat this, we're we're screwed, anyways, because she's here. But hey, I'm gonna give it a four. We're gonna go down fighting. Okay, here we go. Come on. Yeah, hit Adam Campbell with the weakness. Impossible, he said. All right, and then free spray Kaiwan. <laughs> Jesus, can't see anything. All right, here we go. Here it comes. Use the skill. Wait. How much health does Adam Cadmon have? I can't even tell. Oh no, he has like, yeah, okay, he has 99999, yeah. Yeah, we're fucked. <laughs> Alright, well, it was a good try, though. It was a good try. It was, if we went out, oh god, I got a good persona for once, too. It's like actually the show I wanted. Oh, like, and then it's literally two super, no, one boss is not even beatable. One actually impossible to beat enemy. What is wrong with this game? And hey, remember the two enemies we tested the, um, the, the skill we got on? The uh, manifest book? Right? Those were like, what was it? Ellie Gore? And, um, I don't remember. But, like, two easily beatable enemies. And then the fight we actually need to beat? 
Adam Cadmon 99999 health. And, and, uh, and, and Carolina. Cinema. To be fair, we did sit there for like 20 minutes to beat Shadow Sai, who had what, again? Um, 65,000. So like, this took what, 20 minutes of, of rushing? We could have beat him, in theory. It would take like, I guess like 30, 40 minutes. But we could beat him by just rushing. The problem is Caroline had us screwed anyways. Because like at this point I'm so desperate, I might have just actually taken that. <laughs> but we were screwed anyways. Okay. Okay. Roll in the persona. Why does it take so long? Wait, what? Okay. Atis! Wait, was that on screen? Oh, whoops, I didn't show it on screen. Whoops. Uh, yeah, we rolled Atis. Sorry. Eighty-two. Damn. Hold on. Hold on. Maragi dying. Salvation and Thermopylae, which isn't that useful because I have to be surrounded to use it, but I'll take that. I'll take that. Um, Maragidine is probably the, the useful one here for this fight. Um, Null Fire, Repel Wind, and Weak to Curse. Okay, I can do that. Um, do you have traits? No, because traits unlock, um, I think in the Madarame arc. So no trait, unfortunately. And then, random skill, 488. Oof, that's a risky number. <laughs> what? What? This is a Shido fight, right? Beast King's Wrath? Yeah, that's Shido. That could be good. That could be good. That could be good. I should write something. I can work with this. I hope. I think the skill will work. I think the skill will work. I think the question is how much damage will it do when we're. Well, I mean, we have to Addis is good though. He's good stats, right? I, I think is your level taken into account too though because you're like level like three <laughs> or five whatever. Oh. Oh. Wait, what? <laughs> this is just a regular fight. Did I not randomize? Oh, I didn't. I just I'm I'm looking at it right now. I just put the regular encounter file in. Nice. Base. I thought no one would notice. I just I thought they would notice. Wow, how lucky to get the regular encounter. Phew. Oh boy. I'm a lucky boy. You know, it is technically possible. We could have just got that. It is technically possible. That we get the exact... We get the same field. We get the same four enemies. If I was Dream, it would have been easier. Would have been free. Are dream jokes still relevant? It's been like how many years? I'm never letting it go. Never. I just hit new game. Fuck. Ha. Hey, look, there's music playing. Not <laughs> surprise, guys. What? Why did? YouTube keeps harassing me. They keep going verify it's you by confirming on your phone. Yeah. It's still me. Who do you think's streaming right now? Nice. It did like the, the game isn't opening. This is so good. This is so good. Uh 
Okay. Technically, you could just get the entire game in normal encounters. True. Sure. I should just do a randomizer on this, like... Guys, we just got really lucky today. Everything's normal. Huh. <laughs> what? Well, silly little me. What is this guy doing? What are you trolling? Take this. I'll reveal your true form. Okay. Well, that one wasn't normal. I'm having a good day today. This is a good day. This is a good day. This is a good, good day. Every time we crash, I'm going to add a new emote to my chat. What emote are we adding this time? This time we're adding on page 25. All of these suck. What is hydrate, bro? Yepcock. I'm adding a yepcock. There you go. What is that? Emote? Is that the command? There you go. Alright. Put me back in. Why is it not showing up in the in the overlay? This is the worst day ever. This is the worst day of my life. Oh no, Yepcock. Take this. Woke took away Yepcock. Show me your true form. I missed the metaphor stream. Alright, this time I'm adding... I'm adding the emote. I'm adding... I'm adding the type racer emote! You're goddamn right. Could have been better. Could have been better. Could have been better. But that was alright. Oh, okay. Kind of fumbled. Kind of fumbled near the end there. Suboptimal. But hey. That's like the that's like the theme of today's episode. Suboptimal fucking runs. It's the theme of the whole series. All right, 10 number 50. It's such a good number. 50. Come on, give it. Oh, I'm going to kill you with a rock. Oh, I'm going to fucking kill you. Uh, man, who made this randomizer? I need to fucking kill them. I need to hurt them. Oh, wait a minute. Was that a violent threat on Twitch.tv towards another person? Hold on. Hold on. Wait, no, it wasn't because hold on. Who made Royal Randomizer? Oh, if it isn't Screen Mints. Absolute cinema. Why didn't the game launch? Why the emote are we adding? I don't know why it, it, it won't show the emotes after I add them. It's like it's like there's like a cooldown. <laughs> but it shouldn't be. Scream Elements is just shit. Like I want to add emotes and they don't show up on screen. It's like the best part. Like I can see cinema down there. Okay, what the fuck? Empty-headed fucking dumb fuck. Screenman's going into business for himself. What'll I ever do? 
in this world to deserve it. Alright, this one's the one, guys. Okay, it is attempt number 50. Can we keep in mind, thematically, that's like a good number, because it's half of 100. Is there a list of emotes that work? Um, if you have the 7TV extension installed, there should be like a little menu you can use those. Okay, this is the one. Come on, don't Show crash on me. <gasps> oh, this looks not that bad. This isn't the worst. Okay, hold on. Okay, you should be free. Uh, doable. Uh, maybe doable. Uh, this looks okay, actually, for once. Not the most interesting enemies in the world, but that's the that's the good part. All right, uh, we have wind weakness. Can't do anything about that. We have gun weakness. Okay, so we can get two baton passes off. Cool. Um, we might also want to freeze or shock. What do we have? What skill do we have? Maragi die or Beast King's wrath. You know what? I have a plan. Shock him. Wait. Oh, these two are both strong against physical, and then this guy repels it. Well, I still want to try out Beast King's Wrath, so we're still going to try. Nice. Nice miss. Alright. Let's see it. Ooh, oh, it repelled and killed me. <laughs> oh. Oh, okay, okay, okay. There's a way of dealing with that. Everyone calm down. Everyone calm down. There is a way of dealing with that. So what you might not know, but if you're a real... Okay, thanks for that. Thanks for that, Morgana. Thanks for ruining this. Thanks for ruining this. No, you know what? I don't even want to do this one now because he just ruined he just ruined it by getting by yeah. That's nice. I can just it's like instant reset button too. Okay, okay. If you're a real Persona Five royal connoisseur, don't attack the robot. Good. You you should know that there actually is a way to attack enemies with physical that have a resistance to it. And that avenue of doing so is named Freeze. If I freeze our Habaki, his little repel physical isn't gonna do shit. So that's what we're gonna do. Um, yeah. Pass here. Air cannon, this one. Now we have three baton passes, and this should be, it should go down like absolute cinema. That was not bad. This guy's not phase at all, though. I might have to freeze you, too. But I'll give it one more. Oh, no, wait, no, I can't, because he's going to repel it. Um, okay. Okay. We're going to freeze... I could Maragi Dine. What stopped me from Maragi Dine? Nothing. I didn't stop me from Maragi Dine. Yeah. We'll follow up with that. Ooh. Why did you live? Why did both of you live? Why are you alive? Have you considered how I feel about you being alive? Get the fuck out of here with that shit. Okay. 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 Um, I'm gonna freeze the elephant. And we're gonna... Our Abaki won't hurt us, I don't think. Too much. Hopefully. That's the hope. Okay. Annoying, because I can't get the baton pass on. Less annoying. No, actually, no. No, it's, that is annoying. Why can you take our Abaki and get rid of his stupid magical thing? That's actually really not good. 
Because now I can't... Uh, okay, I'll break with on, because she's just elemented anyways. And then... Oh my god. Freeze him. Oh, it's all going... Oh, he's dead anyways. Oh, it's all going down like clockwork. I don't get my baton passes, but... Ooh! You don't deserve this. You deserve to be frozen again. Nice. That's actually good, because it won't break my freeze then. Okay. Uh, no baton passes, so... Um, I don't know. Just kind of do nothing, I guess. Come on, again, again! Spam the move! Oh, he's almost dead. He's gonna wake up now, though. <gasps> what an asshole! He miracle punched me, the prick! He didn't even crit! Okay. Yeah, burn is pretty good in randomizer because it's percent damage, yeah. Okay. That's doable though, I think. But wow, that was not nice. Um okay, we're gonna start Naharabaki again because he has to die first, he repels. And I still want my baton passes, so I'm using energy for him. Uh pop. Pop. Bop. Bop. God, that is so good. You think my Maragi down again, Arabaki just dies here? And I just try to tank the elephant attack? He does. Oh, oh, I dodged! Okay, okay. Oh, he's burned now, though. Ain't that bad? Because now I can't ailment him. Okay, um... Okay. Um, the problem is he's burned, and I'm pretty sure I can't ailment him... When he already has an ailment, it's just not how that works. Um, so I'm gonna have to wait it out now. And I'm hungry anyways, actually, so I probably have to wait out regardless, because I'm gonna do no damage if I'm hungered, so. Um. Yeah. I'm gonna do this. Put it back at full SP, and we're just gonna guard until this hunger ailment's gone. And his ailment, too. Oh, cut right up. He's at least taking burn damage. What does hunger even do? Uh, you do less damage when you're hungered. Almost, like, very little damage. Or is it half? I don't know. I, it seems like, like a really small amount when I've attacked with it. Okay, come on. Get rid of his burn. Okay, nice. Okay. Okay, he still killed him. We'll revive. We'll revive to give him a target that isn't Joker. Okay. Freeze him. Nice. Um, I think Maragi done. Ah, that did like nothing. Don't. Okay. Oh, he got one more. It's so winnable. Yeah, I should just froze him again. Yeah, I should just done that. I don't know why I decided. Yeah, you know. yeah, that's on me. You're, I no, no, I refuse to do this suboptimally. Yeah, thanks for the pass. Yeah, thanks. Yeah, thanks. Thanks, man. Should we stun gun elephant instead? Won't the resist physical damage carry over, though? We'll still technical hit. What the hell? Good. 
Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Is it possible to get YouTube chat on screen? Uh, it is, but I feel like having two chats is then, then it gets too clustered. Twitch chat's the one with all the funny emotes, so. But I still read both. Alright, I think Ben Maragi Dine is smart, because I have to, because Arabaki's alive. Oh, wait, did I not get a one more off that? No, I must have. No, I didn't. Yeah, that's annoying. Why didn't I get one? And I'm hungered again. This is really- and he's burned again. It's like the same thing again. Uh, well I don't want you attacking. But I also need Joker's hunger to be gone. You think we can still kill him while hungered? Okay, he didn't even freeze. Absolute cinema. This is going great. Nice. Okay, I need to revive. Okay, this is going really badly. Um. Please don't hurt me. Okay. Um. Wow, what the hell is going on? Fine. You really want me to try? That employee gave up. I'm dead, though. Yeah. Okay, that was just a bad one. That was just a bad one. That was just a bad one. Why? Why do you do this? No, I refuse. If I can get rid of- yeah, no. Okay, Morgana. Don't screw me, please. Oh my god, why is he doing this? Like, his AI isn't good. I know that. I know for a fact you're not doing this because you're good. No, you are the one. You're not strong. You just, you're just, you're just dumb. How could you be so dumb? Thank you. Okay. Come on, let's do this. Let's go. Hit him with it. Okay. Oh, why no one more? Okay, if no one more, you know what? Then... Cope, see, from all the pieces. Okay. Don't hunger more or Joker. Okay. I'll take one le like, optimally he does it to Morgana, but... What a dick! I needed that from Moragi Dine. Oh. Okay, well, I, I guess we're just throwing on this team now. I, I don't even want to risk this to get the weakness, because she might attack, uh, Arabaki and break his thing, so... And Ryuki's hunger, this is just amazing. This is actually perfect. I guess nothing. Persona, you're mine. Okay, thank god. Oh my god. Can you just kill him? Okay. You can't even do that properly. Um... Okay, we freeze? Yeah, I do think we still freeze. I don't- just shock- Cause I'm- Don't his resistances persist if he's shocked? Or does technical override that? I don't know. I actually don't know the answer, but fuck it. We'll just keep- we'll just keep going with freeze. 
Um. Let's go. Ravix now. Oh my god! Now I'm not even getting the one mores off this. This is annoying. Is this just to say if you shock the tentacle does less damage? Okay. They're really like like really really making me work for this one. Alright, Hank Hill, we're doing it this run. Because we got Hank Hill. Like, why do they all have to troll me? Oh my god, including my teammates. Thanks, man. One damage. Dimoto! I get one at least. Okay. Now it's just down to Mr. Elephant. And we're gonna freeze you for now. No! What are you doing? What is bro doing? Ah, oh, the fact that this is down is so risky. Okay, at least it's on, at least it's on, at least it's on. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Bring her back so maybe she'll be attacked again. Ah, so annoying though. And Morgana will fuck this every time. Maybe we do just go for Shuck. Screw it. Because Morgana's just gonna screw us every time at this point. Oh my god, wait a minute. He can still. Okay, he didn't. Good. I was gonna say, he can still screw us. Um. Uh, nothing for now. Come on. Damn it. Ooh, one more here at least. Uh, I can't imagine the AOA does much, so. Oh, come on. We're so close. Oh, you're already covered. Please. Okay, Rebellion. Okay. Okay, okay. We can win this. This is winnable. This is it. Uh, I'll use Sun Gun just because I want to use all my Spree Sprays, because those are useful. Nice. This is it. Hank Hill, I told you. The second I saw him, I knew we were winning this. I leveled up. Oh, level 14. I'll take that. That's nine levels. Okay. Our, our, look at that. We have some decent, um... We have some decent... Decent levels now. And it was all because we sell freeze spray and stun gun accessories. No? Okay. Uh, uh... 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 Yeah, no shot. Saving the game! Alright, I'll take these items while I'm here. That's okay. I think that's a, what, accuracy evasion on? Oh, that's the fence up? Okay. It's on Merciless? This is on Hard. Um, the reason it's on Hard instead of Merciless is because Hard is technically part of the Merciless, because Merciless is three times technical crit and weakness damage, um, where Hard is not. So, yeah. 
Just to really make sure I hate myself. Need a candle stand. All right, uh, we have to get into this fight, but we don't actually have to do it. Like we can, we can escape. I'll reveal your true form. And escape, I think we will, because he's. Oh yeah, Thor is. Yeah, yeah. Uh -uh. Can we escape? Um, I'm not risking that. Chen. We will be taken. Alright, now I get to do this puzzle. This one, whew, This one always trips me up. I've done it probably like hundreds of times at this point. At least it feels like it. Ugh, God, pressing those two levers. Some, some, one day I feel like I'm gonna mess it up and press the wrong lever. And I'll be like, oh no, I'm, I messed it up. The punishment is... I don't even know if there is one. In vanilla, wasn't it they spawned an enemy, but didn't they change that around? If they did, I did not put that on my Vanilla Royal Differences video. Because I'm a fraud. Somewhere. Physical alignment. I, that's actually very useful. This stuff to sell to a Y is always nice, I guess. You know what is different? <laughs> no jump scare shadow here. And we all mourned. Enemies do spawn if you mess it up? Oh, okay, so they just keep it. Okay, I would know, because like I said, I've done that that one so many times. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know. I'm bragging. Yeah, just a little bit. I mean, how many people <laughs> how many people get stuck on that puzzle? Like, <laughs> I don't know what lever to press. A what, third eye? Never heard of it. Something. Energy charm, what's that? Energy drop. Uh... uh, uh, uh. Ailment cure, can't complain. Uh, give it to Morgan, I guess. Good old Morgan. Good friend of the stream. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not bothering fighting these guys. They shouldn't They shouldn't be so easy to bypass if they want me to- Ooh. That's a good melee weapon! I might just be regular attacking on Morgana for a while if that- if it- if, if the damage is that good. That's a good Morgana melee weapon. Oh, now this one. This one's like advanced brain. This is a giga brain activity right here. You have to go to the back and press that one. Holy. What were they cooking? You know what, though? It's still more fun than any Persona 4 dungeon. And you can quote me on that. Close, close, close the thing. Close it, yeah, okay. And crawl through like a real phantom thief. Yeah, it is like an endgame weapon. I thought it was named like, what was it called? Like Dark Cutlass or something? I thought it would be like, um. I thought it'd have like, I don't know. Curse boost or something, but I guess not. But I'll take it. Actually, wait. Why would it have curse? Because we're gonna use curse. Oh, Give shit. Resist curse, then. But then why would it be dark? Resist less. Look at that. I'm already smarter than every Atlas stuff. I just ran through all the possibilities. Okay. Um, force battle coming up. Like for realsies. Um, this one. Uh, you don't have to defeat. But. Lucky you guys. do have to get it down to like 33% of its health. Um, runs have died on this one. It's it's not to be taken too lightly. So we'll see. Show me your true form. Titania. Oh, Memento's mini boss. This might be a little scary, but we we have pretty good stuff. So wait, why can't I do this when I'm not surrounded? Oh, it won't let me, right? No. Um. Okay. 
Let's start with this. Not bad, yeah, this should be free then. You get the crit right here. Nice. Good crit. You get the crit right here. Nice. Good crit. You get the sleep right here. Uh, nice. Good sleep. Thanks. Bye bye. I think that should be it. Yep. You have unlocked Persona Trace, that's why. Does um, Atis even have the uh, one that allows you to use surrounded skills when not surrounded? I don't even know. I don't even know what his trait is. Breeze Ring. That gives uh, somebody Garo. We'll give it to Ryuji, just in case he's feeling a little. feeling like he wants a little bit of a Garo. about the grappling hook and all the things you can do with it like grapple onto these predetermined hooks personally Focus. if atlas was based hold on <laughs> that's literally the one we have good troll good troll um man, oh man, this is if they're based you can use it wherever you want and then go out of bounds and skip everything in every palace game design I will be taking the safe room. Good point. Let's do it. Shouldn't we're gonna attack normally? Good point, yeah. But I, we kind of have them back. I wanted the crit just so I could, with the lucky punch, just so I could pass back to Joker, Joker there. Because that, that's why Morgana actually is good in randomizer. Um, like, getting passes back to Joker, very good. Or just downing enemies in regular battles so you can leave earlier. Um, always, like, good. So, being able to crit, like, when in doubt, if you can't attack a weakness, just crit in. Very useful. And Morgana learns Lucky Punch and Miracle Punch, which have uh, high crit rates, so. There's a strong shadow ahead. And that's it pretty early. He's not touching On's usefulness, because On learns sleep, which is like goaded. Um, but you know. It's good. It's good to have around. Except he seems to miss all the time. Uh I forgot the thing, the other book. This one, the slave one. Want you equip the armor? Which armor? I'm pretty much using all the good armor I have. The Sudi armor is, um... If the armor says Sudi, you have to clean it in the laundromat for it to be, like, useful. Hmm. Oh, well, I didn't put the box in. <laughs> King, Queen, and Slave. Okay. Uh, forced battle coming up, but, to be clear, this one is not randomized. Because the game, if you randomize this one, it, it doesn't like it. It's very upset when you randomize this one. So, it's gonna be a regular old battle. Which, you know what? I can't even complain, because this this encounter is like, eight enemy, or no? Um, six enemies? Because it's, it's two waves. Is Beefcake Book Protein Reward randomized? No, it's protein every time. Even a randomizer. I want to find out how to randomize, like, regular uh, items too, but I don't really know. The loot objects are randomized. But that's all I really know. Terrified. Petrified, even. I'm glad we actually got XP from the Baton Pass fight. You don't know how rare that is. Typically, we'll, like, we'll go through hell beating that fight, and we'll never get XP. At least, like, hey, these guys are, like, level 14 now. That's, like, okay. It's, like, an okay spot to be in. Oh, no. There's a powerful looking shadow. Can't randomize this enemy, but yes, bosses. Uh, it depends on the boss. Kamachita um, won't be randomized, for example, because he doesn't work randomized. But because I feel like it's a little bullshit that we get to get away from the boss unscathed, um, we do a random encounter, which is like a, a random three enemies to make up for it. 
Uh, oh, I forgot to get the chest with the uh, Ryuji mail up, and it's probably not worth going back for, though. It's not that useful. Alright, this one is a force together, by the way, uh, to be clear. So, um, yep, we'll, we'll see what happens. You will pay for oh, apparently I'm gonna pay for Foolish doing to find King Kamashita with my life. This is, this is randomized. This would happen. Well, we don't have a choice. One enemy. Take it down. Come on. What? As I thought. Okay, this is scary. I don't know what As I thought is gonna do. Oh no, I have so much hell. Can I crit it? <laughs> Can I forget it? Oh, I should have Tarkaj then. Can I sleep it? Who would have thought? What are you gonna do? Oh no, it does attack. Oh shit. Oh fuck, this could be really bad. How much health does Azathoth have? Oh no. I mean, it depends on the phase, but it's either 6,000 or 12,000. So, really, both ways, I'm, I'm not in, in in good company. Oh no. Okay, hold on. Hold on, though. Hold on. I can't throw my map away. Um, we do still have a source of infinite attack, which is nice for no SP cost. I should have healed before the fight. Um, I do have Tarukaja to make myself do more damage. And I do have Tarunda to make Azathoth do less. That's a start. Oh boy. He, he really is, yeah. He really is trying to do something. How'd you know? I can grit this. Oh my god. Yeah, I mean, they expect you to have, like, 900 health for this fight. Okay, that's a bit of a lie. But, like, they expect you to have good endurance and, and good health and... And... It's time. <laughs> I might be fucked. That's like good damage. I don't know why I'm bothered healing like it matters. Be reps. Fuck, oh, don't tell me I got Beast King's Wrath. I got at it. They always dangle this in front of my face. Like things are going so well, and then. You know what? You know what I want to see coming? I did physical uh, one minute based. He can't beat me. Kill him. That was actually okay. But yeah, I'm just fucked, aren't I? It's important to guard if you think you're in danger. Yeah, I'm sure that'll fucking save me. I don't know. 
Ah, oh, I feel like it's winnable if I just he didn't do so much damage. Touch. How much damage is that? 200, 400. So what, 200 every turn and I have to get to... It looks like he was taking decent damage, so he's probably the... Probably the, the easier version of himself, but that's still 6,000 damage, yeah. Oh, it is, yeah, because he's using the skills from the easier version of him. Second phase, he starts so adding in more. The game is over. Um, he's using memory blow. Nuke... Memory blow is only... Hmm. Nuclear crush... Raining Seeds, Amplify Force. Greatly reduces damage from all attacks, including Almighty if all- Oh, okay, there's no tentacles. What a true- But I- it, it's probably still not doable, though. Yeah, I actually... Yeah. All right. Persona! Persona! Too slow. Oh, we dodged! I don't think that'll help that much. I like how it actually knows he's charging. That's very funny. Should we guard it? Should we listen? Will it matter? We can try. But now we can't dodge if we guard. Oh, I have that. Oh, so I didn't have to guard long. Jokers. Ooh. 400. Like, no, I don't. It's not beatable. I'm like mind fucking myself and thinking it's beatable, but it's not. What a sick joke. You can't kill me. You can't hurt me. Alright, it's over. Fine, why'd it have to be as a thought? That's a good point. If we had somebody who was like, 
null nuke or like null uh, fizz, we could just win. Wasn't Addis? I've already forgotten. Addis was not, he was reflect wind, block fire, which is not going to help me against, against uh, Mr. Azathoth, unfortunately. So he uses physical and nuke damage. But if we had those things, that would have we actually would have won. Damn it! If I had even no, I, I would probably need both actually, because he's these two. The physical one would be more useful, but fuck. With insane luck, I mean, with like the most insane luck in the world, where we dodge everything, but then. By that logic, everything's beautiful. <laughs> um, it's not at all feasible. Well, that's annoying. Okay. Well, we got close. Um, I don't really feel like doing another run. So, fuck it. We ended there for today. Fuck, that was good up until the end where we lost. Um, you know what I'll leave you with? I'll leave you with a fun fact about Azathoth. Straight from the Persona 5 Royal art book that has never been officially translated, so I had to go do every single page individually in Google Translate. I'm gonna find the pic- the, the, I'm gonna find... Here we go. This is Azathoth's Azathoth, Azathoth page. Here's the- here's the- the, the concept art right here. Look at that. Mmm. Well, that's hard. We don't really get this. Adam Cadmon kinda looks like that, but... It is designed to have a spinal cord-like core that will later connect to Adam Cadmon so that we can imagine div divinity in a chaotic, amorphous existence. The English is kind of broken. It's machine translated, after all. Apart from the setting drawings, there is a second form that has countless tentacles like Senju Kanon. But it was created at the discretion of the site, so there were no design drawings. Although the design of the shape and structure was difficult, I learned a lot from this model and was able to experience the fun of making games. This is an unused design, I guess, right? As a thought alternative. Yeah, this is never used in game. This is actually hard as fuck. I guess this works. Oh, so it is like, yeah, it is supposed to be like a spinal cord. Yeah, I guess I never really fully paid attention. Yeah, it's like, kind of like a spine. And that's like the brain. The head and back parts are not included. This design's kind of hard, though. I couldn't find this illustration in the art team, so I discovered it from the local work data, data of the model person. Maybe this is a design that hasn't come out into the world yet, sleeping on someone's PC. I also like this design when I received it as a draft in the middle of the process, and it was eerie. I wonder what it would have looked like if they had made a second version. I assume he means like if they had actually 3D modeled this. Damn. This would have actually been terrifying. Wow. Anything else? Any other good memes? I didn't even translate this one, why not? What? Did I forget? Wait, what? Why are none of these translated? These are. Oh yeah, the unused Showtime uh, uh, icons. Um, These ones are new to the art book. We never saw these ones before. These ones were in the, uh, the files for the game. Yeah. That's all the achievements. Uh... Hey, there's Azathoth again. Oh my god. What were they cooking? Oh my god, what were they cooking? Hey, the thieves then. They should have shown more, more on YouTube shit. But I feel like there is more. 
Damn, so many of these got butchered by Google Translate. Oh, these! The unused, um... Uh, transform panel ones in, in, as, um, like, uh, pixel art. These are cool. But I get why they would kind of want to use. They don't really fit the style that much. Showtime. Oh, these are, like, concept arts or something? This is not how it looks in the final game. Oh, another concept art? That's fucking hype. They didn't say a goddamn word about the unused Prince of Ketchuan, but I imagine it probably didn't get very far, I guess. Or the unused uh, Ryuji Mono one. There's a few unused show times. And the the theorized, but I don't know if it's actually in the files, but um, people theorized that there would have been a Sumeria Ketchuan too. I don't know if that's ever been confirmed. Oh, the hard-ass one. Look at this hard-ass concept art. This is not really how it plays out in the final game, though. They're shooting at each other. Oh, in the early draft, there was a scene at the beginning where the main character and Akechi were at odds, which would be this. Um, the main character shoots Akechi in the head, gets revenge on him, and then Akechi wakes up and so on, but that was shell. Damn. I mean, you kind of get a similar kind of shot to this when Joker's shooting the enemy and then that. <laughs> what is she cooking down here? It's an okay art book. They should have shown more, more concept art instead of it. I mean, it's so cool. I think the original games had a uh, was better though. Like Persona 5 Vanilla's uh, art book? Yeah. Okay, I'm ending. I'm ending stream. I'm out. Okay. Um. The internet has been translated somewhere. Where well, we saw on the Persona 5 subreddit today, funnily enough, uh, they're releasing an official English translated version of this. Because I Google translated this back when it released in Japan. Um, what's it called? Official Design Works. How much is that? I can get the uh, vanilla one for $75. Oh no, this isn't French. <laughs> I, I, the English one is out of stock. And I, I can't even, I don't even know where you buy the royal one. Fine, it'd be nice to have to just like sit in there. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, this is a Japanese version, though. Yeah, I think the English one's, like, either coming out or just came out. Uh, I don't know where the fuck you'd buy it. Okay. I'm out. I'm gone. I'm leaving. I'm never coming back. I'm just kidding. I am coming back. But, at a later date. Um, okay. Uh, next YouTube video. <laughs> I don't know about next, but, um... Hopefully I finally finish that randomizer intro so I can actually start uploading vanilla randomizer uh, stuff. Edit it down. That'd be cool. Get back on that grind. Um, vanilla Royal... I don't know. IDK. But we might start cut content soon because that's fun to talk about if you haven't noticed. Even just now I was talking about cut content. You know, you know how much cut content there is? You, there's something about... There's something, there's already so much content in the game, but it's not fun to talk about any of that. It's fun to talk about what's not in the game. Isn't that weird? It's like forbidden fruit tastes the sweetest. Okay, I'm done. I'm out. For real. For real this time. Bye-bye.